the key question here is what are biologic medications? So before the biologic era, most medications were chemical structures. That's why they, most of them you know, were pills. They were chemicals that would interrupt uh, with a broad sort of uh, process. Um, biologics are, are quite different. The biologic era started with really an advance, advancement in science and what we call molecular techniques where scientists were able to determine specific proteins or molecules that would cause inflammation. And once that happened, you could take different diseases, tonight we're talking about IBD, and say, well, is that molecule or protein very, very important in causing, in this case, inflammation? And once you've done that, you can target, instead of targeting something broadly, you can target that specific molecule. Now to do that, you need to, you need to, to develop what we call an antibody. And an antibody is another protein. So it's not a simple, it, it, and it's a complex structure. It's not a simple chemical where there's a recipe to it. And because of that, biologics are produced in living systems. So um, by definition, it's any virus, therapeutic, toxin, or antitoxin that you can use for the prevention, of treat prevention, treatment, or cure of disease or injuries of man. So that's a big scientific sort of uh, uh, definition. They can be derived from a variety of living sources. And in the end, what we're developing is these therapeutic uh, proteins.